So now do I go back? Now that I have the cogs? Oh, what's this stuff? Oh, there they are. Let me just go play with the cogs. Because I think that's all of them. I'm not sure I like this puzzle design. Because the thing is, you don't know. The game doesn't really give you any hints that you want the second set of cogs before you turn the wheels. Like, it's only after you've done it that the game tells you, oh, you could have gotten better stuff if you found the other cogs. And so it's like, it's a puzzle that really requires you to load the game after you learn how the puzzle works, which I'm not a big fan of. Alright, so you go repair. Using both sets of cogs to do repairs, you repair five of the wheels. Yeah, like that. The damage to the other three wheels is more expensive than you can repair, but you doubt you can restore the system any more than you have. The meditation wheels rest here quietly. Thanks for your repairs, five of them will spin again. You think that repairing the others could take months. Spin the wheels. The repaired wheels spin smoothly. Meditate. You feel a sense of calm as you meditate, listening to the water of the dragon font and the quiet of the You are certain you have gained all you can from meditating with these wheels. After a few moments, something in the mechanism gives way. Convenient with the dragon, venture of inspiration. Right. Yeah, like that. Like, you need to find everything in order to get the best stuff out of it. Which, I mean, it makes sense, but the game doesn't communicate it clearly. Uh, should I level up Stone and Mortal? And like, there's so many, so many styles that we never use. I don't even use this. Really. Damage increase. Duration increase. Alright, let's go chat to our friends. I suppose everybody will have stuff to say. That's not tent. I can go in the tent. Hey lads. You are here, alive. We we thought you were dead, and then I had visions of the strangest things. Strangest things, you say? Dawnstar guided us to this place, but I expected a ghost, not flesh and blood. The water dragon returned me to life. Oh, you walk in the parks of many gods. I will build something extra large to explode with my surprise. What does that even mean? You must be of great standing in the eyes of heaven. Mortals do not return from beyond in their own form. <laughs> Chaika. It weakened her greatly. I must try to set things right. I've learned much about the choices I will have. She has placed a great deal of trust in me. Uh, I must try to set things right. Such creatures are not accustomed to needing assistance or being called on to assist. Both circumstances would likely annoy them. Annoyances go. I think ours is more pressing. Or have you all forgotten the entire army of the Aberon? Uh, the entire Imperial Army is coming. Dawnstar was not the only one aware of your return to life. Or something the spirit realm has alerted suddenly. Your former master, my uncle, has taken the Jade Empire as his own. Emperor Sun Li has set the whole of his forces against us, and we are trapped here in Dirge. We'll be fine. Why would he set the whole army against us? Because we're the only ones who can stop him. <laughs> After you defeated my... my father, and Li struck you down, he claimed both your amulet and the heart of the Water Dragon and announced that his rule had begun. The Lotus Assassins were his almost immediately. Your amulet must have allowed him to quickly do what it took my father years to accomplish. 
The water dragon told me it was powerful, focusing to... We had no choice but to flee. In the days after, the new emperor did not seem overly concerned with capturing us, and we did not know where to go. He didn't consider us a threat. We had no way of fighting him. Just as with Sun High, only a spirit monk can face him with hope of success. Don't sell yourself short. That's why we came here. Dawnstar's vision seemed impossible, but any hope was better than none. Unfortunately, Emperor Sun Li sensed your stirrings in the spirit realm as well, and now we are trapped. Uh, there's no way of avoiding them sneaking flight. Only one path is passable by foot, and that is the route they are coming up. I cannot sneak past such a horde. My marvelous dragonfly will not survive the passage either. The winds force a certain path, and the army's flyers are guarding it well. Wait, we're leaving but on foot? That is our luck, as well as our sorrow. Their inferior flyers can barely stay aloft in such currents. They will not overrun us from the air, at least not in numbers. We are walking out and leaving the flyer behind. Then we will raise our defense here and come what may. This is not the glorious task that what the dragon said was before me. Lee sent his army to do what he could not. I'm not afraid. Um... We have a little time. They are still at the base of the mountain. I'd say the main force won't be here until tomorrow. Ah, uh, cool. We will start securing the temple. The great gates of this place will grant us some valuable time. At least they will not take us by surprise. Right. Fortifications. Hmm. Perhaps I will remove some of the ordnance from the marvelous dragonfly. Properly applied, it may prove useful tomorrow. Come, Whirlwind. I need your muscle. That's the Black Whirlwind. And as long as it makes the coming fight more interesting, I'll lift whatever you want. That is all we can do for now. Tomorrow we'll decide our fates. We should all get some rest. But if I could have a word with you when the others have gone, I need to speak with you. I'm sure you all want to talk to me. Pretty sure everybody wants to talk to me. When you're ready, go to your tent to retire for the night. Alright, well, we're not ready yet. Bones! Nothing. Nothing in the bones. So, should I check the only shop I have left, which is this guy? Ah, uh, excellent! I have many Cyclone items just gem, for you. Damage shield. Uh huh. Burning essence, golden tongue. Hundred percent chance to evade traps. This is uh, I mean, it's kind of interesting. The tiger has even more styles that we're never gonna find time to use. Leaping tiger, white. Demon. I guess Leaping Tiger is awesome. Path of the Warrior, Health 50, Chi 50, Focus 50, and they cost 50,000 silver each, which I don't have. Warrior of the Unyielding Heart, I'll, I'll buy this one because I can't afford it. Wow, look how expensive this stuff is. Do I want the styles? No? Alright. Alright, I'm just gonna buy more stuff while I can. Save the game. Alright, let's talk to the princess. I was wondering when we'd find time to be alone. Everyone has been hovering about you since you got back. I literally just got back. I have been afraid to talk to you. I worry that you might have changed, that you might have forgotten me. Why would I forget you? Do you still feel the same way for your heavenly lily? This is so awkward. <laughs> Does anyone really speak like that? Maybe they do in private. I don't know. <laughs> that depends. Is she still willing to take what makes her happy? Uh, I haven't been able to stop thinking about you. Well, I've been thinking about a lot of other things, so that's a lie. Let me just go for the top one then. I haven't slept since you fell. You should sleep. For all the influence my position is supposed to carry, I was as helpless as a lamb. But now, to have you back here with me, it's almost too much to bear.
I'm trying to think who, what kind of person wrote this stuff, and what kind of person is it meant to be for? I'm not a very romantic person, you might have noticed that. I don't know if you, if you noticed that, <laughs> but I'm not really a romantic person. I will never leave again, if it's too much I could leave again, not by the same method I hope. Uh, I'll never leave again. I'll never leave. Never. Not even after I die. Is that is that too much? <laughs> I wish that saying it would make it true, but there is so much that is uncertain. I will haunt you forever. I, I am truly frightened about tomorrow, but I know I am safe here with you. Whatever comes, thank you for showing me how to care for people. I have never been closer to anyone. You should care about everyone, not just me. Oh, awkward lesbian sex time. Why am I suddenly bigger than it? Oh, that's it? Implied lesbian sex? It's not even actual lesbian sex, it's just implied. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Was there other stuff we could have done before we went to sleep? Hold on, no, I'm gonna load the game. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I can't skip this. You have done well to restore the Fountains of Dirge, but they cannot shield you fully. Not with the power I now control. This is nothing more than a dream, my pupil. I can do nothing here, but I can influence things. Do you remember your fellow students? Yeah, your brother killed them. <gasps> Literally a dragon. They certainly remember you. They remember how you left them to die. You also left them to die. Uh, I could have saved them, I could. Your plans are what killed them. This is all you can summon, Lee. They were nothing to me. Your plans are what killed them. They died, so there would be nothing holding you back. Their deaths ensured that you were properly motivated. Without you, they would still be alive. Without you, they'd still be alive, old man. I'm gonna load the game. I'm not sure... Was there other stuff we could have done? Alright, we're gonna, gonna... Come through and do this again. Cause there was like a... What the? That was sudden. Alright, there's a random ghost. So could I come down here or not? To the inner courtyard. Alright, that is, that is locked. That is actually locked. You must rest before venturing forth. Okay, I see. So where are my other companions? Can I talk to my other companions before we before we sleep? Are they back here, or are they just gone, just disappeared for some reason? They're not actually here, wow, alright, so I guess they're... Alright. This is weird, I thought we'd get a chance to talk to everyone. No, they're not, they're not here, wow. Alright, well that's awkward. So, can I load quick save? Alright, so I guess. Alright, well, we're gonna have to watch some of this stuff again, that's fine. I thought there was more stuff, but apparently not. Hey, princess. I was one. Uh, whatever comes, thank you for showing me how to care for people. I have never been closer to anyone. You should care about everyone. Look, even the kiss is implied. Look at this. Implied lesbian kiss and then you don't see it. And then you don't see it. Let's go. You don't actually see anything. You have done well to risk. Now 
I see. It wasn't... It wasn't you. Do it. Impressive. But this was only a dream. You will not be so fortunate tomorrow. I don't need fortune. So it's pretty cold here, right? Because we're on top of the mountains. But I still have no pants. Do you think I'm cold right now? Do you think Dawnstar is cold? Oh, golems. That's not smart. You're invading with golems, not invading with people? All we need to do is destroy the jade golems and then all the other ones just go berserk and, and lose their minds. You're awake! It sounds like the army is on the move. They're on their way up the mountain. It's also snowing. Sky left a few hours ago. He said he was going to see how far up the mountain they had come. We haven't heard from them since and... I'm worried. Look! He's back! <laughs> well, that's convenient for my nerves. Uh, sorry for being late. Are you mortally wounded? Are you alright? Fine. Never been better. <clears throat> Once the bleeding stops, I'll be good as new. Don't waste my time with lies. I went down the mountain to scout them out. I figured I could get a good estimate of how many were coming and get back here. It didn't work out like I planned. Of course it didn't. There are Lotus assassins by the score, and golems too. You didn't bury them all. They have a lot more. Imperial army flyers in the distance too. They'll be here soon. We've been escaped bad, by the well. Bad, very bad. What are we going to do? They'll be across the main bridge in no time. Uh... We need to destroy that bridge. They could land anywhere with their flyers. We'll meet them head on. We can meet them head on. Uh, let's destroy the bridge. Yes, we must. The golems are not just the ones you saw before. Bigger ones. Giants. Siege golems. Siege golems? Oh, I've heard of those. Thirty feet tall and can throw an ox. Well, uh, pretty darn far. I didn't have time to measure. Oh, they crush walls too. It would be bad if they reached us. The casks I took off the dragonfly would make short work of the bridge, though. A little fire, and whoosh! Earth meets sky! You will need someone to keep any advanced Lotus assassins away from you. I will accompany you. No, it's too dangerous for just one person. I'll go as well. Go on. Princess, take Dawnstar and protect Kang. Don't start take the princess and protect Kang. Okay? What's the difference? Uh, princess, take the Don't Star. Okay. Of course, Don Star, a chance to prove your worth to me. You too, Kang. I, uh, yes, princess. And what about the rest of us? Why just send them? Why are we sitting here holding our? Oh, I get it. They're coming here too, aren't they? Well, who? The Lotus Assassins, but they'd have to fly to get past the wall and the winds are too strong. Hundreds may die in crashes, but a few will get through. Do you really think Death's Hand minds such losses? Uh, I will hold the area around the temple. Everyone else will stay on my way. If small groups will anyone we should spread out. My wounds will make me a burden if I stay at your side. Yes, they will. I will keep guard over the temple itself. Groups landing there should be small enough for me to handle. Uh, Kang, old friend. I'd like to borrow a few of your marvelously explosive casks. I have something special in mind for any assassins who breach our lines. Does it include blowing what? yourself yes, up? Yes, whatever you want. I have enough on my mind. During the night, I made some, um, reinforcements to the marvelous dragonfly. I don't sleep much, you see. Ever. Anyway, I doubt we could escape, but we can make a dent. A short run in the flyer to take the brunt of their advance. It might be a worthwhile mission, or it might be suicide. 
Well, what isn't these days? It's not necessary. I leave the decision to our illustrious leader. Uh, forget the flying with face on the ground. Fine, let's fight them in the air. We can assault the bridge after.